Hello people out there this is Make Pandya and today we are going to do something very very exciting so i assume you have at least played a game called Watch Dogs um if you play games then you know that uh, there's a hacking kind of thing in which you can do in WhatsApp so let's so we are going to make this so as you can see here this is what we are going to make so let's get started so first thing we are going to use is we are going to do is make a composition call it so we are going to first make the photograph so photo then go to the dimensions and type 700 and go to the duration let's make it 10 seconds okay so let's make it 10 seconds long and click ok so now then go to the rectangle tool go to fill oops go to fill and go to none then click OK. Then go to stroke and solid go to the solid color. Then OK. And then select the black color. And then double click here. And uh, once you double click, then go to the pixels. Increase the pixel size mm, about here. Yes. Now, so now we can see here there are two kind of parts. So we are gonna make that again. So for that, we are gonna use pen tool. So for that, you can go here and click click on the pen tool, or you can also press G. As you can see here. Then you're gonna simply do is click, 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 click. Here. Okay, so let's go to stroke, none, fill, black. Okay, so now we can see that we have to invert the mask. So let's go to M M Oops no here what's wrong What the fuck it's not working Okay select okay so you have to select the shape layer first then only it's gonna work okay like that go to stroke none fill full black okay so now let's make this equal and uh, okay so like that so now we have to invert the mask so press mm why the hell this isn't working for me shape path stroke view Okay, 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 okay. I got what's the problem. 
okay so we have to create a new solid go to the black okay then go to the pen tool now create the mask create the mask adjust the mask okay now go to mm okay now you can see so simply click on the black solid mm and click on the invert so now it's inverted as you can see and now you can just adjust it like so okay so now we have created the photo kind of thing like uh, this and now we have to create this all the other what is it things so let's make a new composition and let's call it uh, watch dogs okay and change the width to 1920 by 1080 click ok and now insert this photo into this 1920 by 1080 thing <coughs> let's put it here okay now for that we are gonna use uh, rulers uh, let's make it here okay so let's press ctrl R to get the rulers and about here line it perfectly now what we are gonna do is create a new solid black and then okay no not like okay and then go to the rectangle tool and then simply make this mask what's the delay to a second mask what's the first mask okay so click on the rectangle tool yes here we go and make this kind of thing like a rectangle kind of okay let's let me make it a little bit bigger so now you can see I have made the rectangle now what you're gonna do is going to align it above the photograph so now you can see okay so now we are gonna make some animations like the slide animation so let's go to effect okay you have to select the black solid first go to effect transition and then uh, where it is where it is linear wipe okay go to the linear wipe 
and uh, do it minus 90 degree so it goes like this to this as you can see so first go to the starting of the video like the comp oh, what do you say the composition then let's fit it 100 percent let's reduce the size fit it 100 okay then make the keyframe of the transition completion kind of thing then go a couple of frames further and then make it to zero so now we can see it's making the transition now what you are gonna do is select the black solid press u and then you can see the two keyframes so what you're gonna do is go to press f9 press f9 or go to keyframe assistance go to easies now we can see the graph it's like a pretty smooth one as you can see now it's gonna go a little smoothly so let's make it even more smoother so let's drag it a little bit backward not like that <laughs> not like that okay 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 it takes about two seconds to make that hmm go here you know like that actually let's go like this mm, no not like that at all okay so we have done this we have created the animation for this now what we are gonna do is create uh, let's just first rename it oh no 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 so le let's name it black header okay and then make it and then let's duplicate it so press ctrl d So now we are gonna do is press Y, take the anchor point, put it around here, and then go to press S for scale and reduce the size a little bit. Okay, not like that. You have to close the chain link and reduce only the like width, not height. So it will look like this okay why is it going like that f9 too easy or go to keyframe assistant easy ease so it will make it a little bit smoother okay so now go to effect and uh, 
okay so go to effect and type wave warp okay and use the wave warp and put it over this get it to zero square and uh, increase this thing Hmm. Phase. Go to zero. Keyframe. Yeah. And uh Let's make a keyframe here. Then go to a little bit for a little bit forward. little bit forward and go to zero okay so now you can see this we have now successfully created um what is it the watchdog effect and then in another so i think i have to end this episode right now right here and in another episode we are gonna do is gonna make some motion tracking and create the video i have shown you in the beginning of the video so this one so if you like this video and want me to do more stuff like that then subscribe to my channel give thumbs up and if you want to me to do something more or make more effects then comment me down below whatever you like and if you want to like see another episode then subscribe and until then see you next time